Yo, uh, let's see what I can do here. Let's see, uh, let's get out of this. Alright, alright, no, it's not working. There we go. Alright, it's your boy, Major Kaidan. Alright, it's a word I came up for this language I'm doing. Here's my hands, here's my little controllers. But that's a word I made up. It means the full armor of God, my brother. He helped me uh, figure out how to uh, come up with a cool name for my gamer tag and all that. So when I got my MetaQuest 3, I was like, all right, got to have a cool name. I'm going with, I uh, was bouncing around tons of ideas. Couldn't come up with anything good. And then my brother was like, all right, uh, what do you think about the full armor of God? And I was like, that's dope but it's not really a name so i thought about a word i was like what kind of word could be a name that sounds like that would be if it was in my language that i'm making it'd be mesha kaidan mesha kaidan that's what it is the full armor of god that's what that word means in my language super cool super dope but anyway i am mesha kaidan i just want to tell you guys some things real quick okay so today i found the biggest discovery of any discovery that i've come up with yet on the meta quest 3 this is my first time having a super cool dope vr headset like this uh my brother got it for me for christmas he had to return his unfortunately because it was giving him nausea and stuff but uh, he just didn't want to stick it out, I guess, but that's all right. That's all right. So this cool discovery is uh, I'm going to show you how to uh, make your screen like a full screen. So um, if you're just going searching on the Internet or you're watching a movie like Disney Plus or something like that, uh, you just want to get on Netflix. I think there's a Netflix app on here so you can do that. But if you're just watching Disney Plus or something else that's not really affiliated with the me the meta uh, company or whatever, that really uh, they just don't have an app ready for the, s the system yet, or I don't even know if they're ever going to, to be honest. I hope one day maybe they could, but this is my workaround, so I figured this out. So right here is your little clock thing. It gives you your time, gives you your uh, your internet service and how well your, your service is doing right there. And then it tells you what your battery percentage. I'm telling you right now, when I first started working on this this morning, when I realized what I did, I stumbled on it on accident, how to switch the size. Because I was like, huh, I wonder what I can figure out if I click on this. So I clicked on it and I was like, okay. So I was looking over all these things, Wi-Fi, pass-through, boundary, Bluetooth, has all these different things, microphone, reset view, night mode, do not disturb, voice command. And we'll just skip this one over here that's a uh, report problem. Uh, but the one that was super cool was switch view. That's what I found out. I was like, switch view. All right, let's take a look at that. So I hit switch view, and then it pops up this big old screen. I was like, that's dope. That's what I wanted the whole time. Now, now honestly, if you keep the view small, it's super cool. Because, you know, you can go up to the edge. You can pull your little trigger up here. That trigger, you can drag it around and stuff. You can move it where you want. Maybe you knew that, maybe you didn't. And you can obviously do that whole uh, just press this button. You can't really see where my thumb is. It's uh, the one that looks like a controller right there uh, or whatever it looks like. And you just press it again and it'll just pop right back up. But that's super dope. But that's not really the point of this video. The point of the video is the switch view right there. That's all you really got to do. So you can close this out. And so what I wanted to do um, was just show you. So I go to my browser and then basically you have the browser up. And so I was looking at like all sorts of stuff like how do I change size and how do I make my screen bigger? So I typed in all this stuff like looking for stuff. I was like, there's nothing for the MetaQuest 3. I was like, why not? Like it's brand new. Somebody's definitely got to figure this out, put a video out like why is there nothing in the top results for MetaQuest 3? I mean, that's what I typed in. How to make browser screen huge on MetaQuest 3. That's what I wanted. So that's what I typed in. And so I looked and there was nothing about MetaQuest 3. How to make your browser huge or how to make your browser screen larger on MetaQuest 3. Or how to resize your screen on MetaQuest 3 or anything like that. There was no MetaQuest 3 anything. So I was like, all right, I'm just going to do a video on this. I don't know if I ever make a video again. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't but who knows who cares it's just a good video so I recorded that's what I'm doing today all right so that's what I started with I tried to figure it out because I stumbled on it on accident and there was nothing to teach me so I just want to know how I did it so basically the only other thing that you need to know about this is you can just come over here to the corner you grab with your trigger and then you can resize to about I mean there's little differences but 
you want like that nice landscape mode you just resize to whatever size you want and then you just point down here to your little bar and you drag it up so like obviously you see my tv right there i mean it's small now you got this and it's super big in front of it all right well i don't want to see my tv like poking out of the bottom like that you see it's poking out of the bottom i don't really want to see my tv poking out of the bottom when i go to watch disney plus later unfortunately though i'm gonna to have to recharge my headset so i can watch uh i watch one of the star wars i'm gonna watch uh the Re revenge of the sith so i'm gonna sit here and watch that one um but anyway so i don't want my tv poking out so i'm just gonna resize that right there and i'm gonna want this big old screen like this i'm, I'm doing like a nice big old screen and if i go to disney plus i mean you might see like, like my little family account and stuff or whatever but i'm already signed into my account and uh so here we go here we go i won't be able to play the movie for you but like i mean here's maybe maybe uh they might well they probably would uh probably would like close my stuff down if um if if i played the movie at all so i probably can't play the movie at all to show you to be honest so i just gotta be able to keep it up and this little this little movie is funny but i think it's really actually for kids i thought it was gonna be a funny like group video where he's kicking butt and stuff but it was not a funny group video where he's kicking butt. He, like, talks to a plant and stuff and becomes friends with a not real tree. Like, he's alive. The tree that he was sitting next to was not alive. I just thought it was funny because it was Groot. I thought it was going to be a funny show. I mean, it's kind of cool for kids, but it's not really for adults. That's why I only got to the beginning of episode two. And they're only, like, yeah, they're only, like, five minutes long. I didn't realize that. So I had started Revenge of the Sith, so that's what I'll be watching. It'll pop up probably in a nice big screen. The next step is to figure out how to remove these bars up here at the top and hide the things. But, I mean, this alone, like, this nice big screen right here, like, even if I just, like, stretch this a little bit more, that would be moved it up i'd have a nice full screen and uh, that's something you guys will have to check out and see on your own because i definitely don't want this video getting taken down um so i don't want to play any movies and since i am not uh uh licensed to be able to show you any of the movies then yeah can't really show you but anyway uh that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna watch revenge of the sith in a little bit after i uh charge my my metaquest 3 up but i just want to show you guys that today that was super pretty simple video right there um, and now you guys know that you can reshape your screen. So let me just run over that one more time real quick, just in case you forgot. Uh, maybe you got to the end of the video and we're like, oh shoot, I forget. Okay, so right here, here's your clock. All right, you see your clock. Look, it just changed 257 to 258. Right there it is. Shows your Wi Fi and uh, your battery. And that's called quick settings. That's that's what that's called. I look for quick settings forever, but this is what's called quick settings right there. Those are your quick settings. Remember that because if something says go to quick settings, you'll remember this little bar with your time and your Wi-Fi and your battery percentage is your quick settings. Now I don't know if there's a way to change what your quick setting displays in your little uh, view down here. I forget what this is called. Like your I forget what that one's called. I'm trying to remember the names of everything, but. Um, this is your quick settings. So you click on quick settings and then you go to switch view. That's what it is, switch view. So look, go small. Now we're in the small mode. And then what, what would happen is we go back to the browser. Now everything's all inky dinky. It's tiny, like a little, little tiny screen. Who wants to watch a movie on a little tiny screen like that? I mean, maybe if I scoot it up on it like this, but then I'm not even relaxing. So I'm gonna get real comfortable, real comfortable. And I'm gonna switch back, all right switch view all right we got that done now i have to move a little bit just to get this where it needs to go move that up go back my browser it's all nice up in the air has a nice curve to it you can see that big old curve screen it's huge it's huge it's huge so that's super nice and uh you can i don't know if you oh that looks like the extent of how big you can make it you can make it smaller maybe the movie's like a super widescreen movie so you just want to make it like super thin and all that who knows who knows what you want to do with it but uh that that's super cool and maybe at some point they'll make it like uh they'll upgrade the software and you'll be able to have like multiple of those screens so you could have like a whole movie on like thin screen and be able to remove this whole bar you'll be able to watch that thin screen right up here be able to watch that whole movie and then down here you could have something playing like another video you're watching a sports event on that one and then 
then over here you could be doing something else so this is like a whole entertainment setup right here in your face and yeah i mean it only lasts for two hours maybe maybe they can give like a nice battery pack that can just attach like right over here to the side of your head or like right over well which side is the battery on i can't remember i think it's on well it doesn't really matter but whichever side the charger's on maybe they just make something it could do a counterweight so both sides could be weighted the same or whatever who knows they could do tons of stuff with this just so you could have extended battery life and be able to play longer and i know they probably do it a little bit so we're not in it all the time but yeah if you made it this far you listen to me ramble too much but uh that's how you do it you go to quick settings you go to switch view that's how you do it it's pretty simple switch view back and close your stuff out well and then close it out all right well now you see me struggle it's a nice and natural way to to make like a super simple video thought it was kind of funny you guys probably laughing at me because i look like a fool and i pull my stuff up and there we go so we got disney plus ready ready to go now we're gonna watch the revenge of the sith and that's what i'm gonna do later so now i gotta go charge this thing and get ready to watch my movie all right later wait maybe maybe all right later